hello, hello. Time yes to roll. Welcome, 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 babies. If you're new here, welcome back. If you are returning, come on in, like, sorry, y'all. Come on in, like, comment, share, subscribe. Thank you guys in advance. Go ahead, kick your feet up. Get your shit, get your shit, get your shit, and get comfortable. Cause we're about to make it do what it do, loves, okay? This is a Divine Connection channel only. Twin flame, twin ray, soulmates, life partners, Divine Connections, Karmic Connections. So we're going to jump into this read. If you're interested in Zodiacs or just regular collective reads, um, you can check out my Purple Priestess channel. The links are down below or my Everything Pisces channel. Check me out on TikTok at Tanya's Tarot. Zodiac signs for all reads are always down below in the description box, loves. Let's go ahead and jump into this read. Let's see what the energy is for today. What's going on when it comes to our divine connection spirit? Okay, somebody's angry. There is someone who is angry. You may be angry and upset. There may be someone around you who is angry and upset. <clears throat> this may be a feminine energy that is angry and upset. This can still be a man in feminine energy. Whoever this is, this is somebody who, who has sex with people for money. They could be materialistic. They don't necessarily have to be um, a prostitute. They could um, only deal with men who... You know, materialistic, who, who pay for things, you know? Yeah, this person has a bunch of unwanted opinions. They talk too much, too. Give me one more. Um, I heard this person could, could go after sugar daddies. Yeah, whoever this is, their copycat want to be you, bitch. I know we got one extra that flew out. Yeah, this person has clouded judgment. So let's see if we can do this thing like this. Like that. Okay, and then we'll put this last one right here. Or maybe we should do it this way so y'all can see it. I think you see it better coming this way. My bad, y'all. I'm trying. I'm trying. Okay. Yeah, look. <laughs> I said sugar daddy, y'all look. Bottom of the deck, sugar, sugar, sugar daddy mature man. <laughs> I told you this this is the type of woman that that goes after a sugar daddy. Somebody that's gonna take care of them. Um if you ain't got no money, if you ain't balling, if you ain't out here, you know, um in in you know, driving big things and wearing big things and all in the name brand and all that, they don't mess with you. Um, and it's never about love, it's, you know what I'm saying? It's always about what they can get. But this person is mad at you here, Collective. This is somebody who wants to be like you. They're a copycat, want to be you, bitch. And their judgment is clouded right now. So I feel like they, I was going to say, I feel like they did some stupid shit, right? And as soon as I said that, I cut on my altering spell. So they could have tried to do some spell work on you here, babies. And that shit backfired. And now, now they, <laughs> yep, they might like you too. They may be into women as well with this like it, lick it, love it. Are they out here licking on on ice cream cones, y'all? Okay. They could be trying to track whoever this sugar daddy is. Yeah, cause they after the money, money grabber here. Let's see. Sorry, y'all, about my own. Hold on, let me raise it up a little bit. I be want y'all to see the cards, but when I go to reach for the cards over there, my arm be in the way. So I raised up. Hopefully, my arm won't be in the way this time. Let's get deeper though into this, cause this copycat want to be you, bitch. Let's see. Let's see. Now, if you're a man and you're watching this, this can still be a masculine energy out here. Um, this is the type of a uh, man that goes after a sugar mama, a woman that's gonna take care of him. You know what I'm saying? If she ain't, you know, if she ain't paying, he ain't laying. That type of energy. And they're angry because, you know what I'm saying, your person 
possibly want to come back to you. We're going to see. But they, they got clouded judgment. So, either way, man or woman, there's somebody out here that wish they was you. They trying to act like you be you. And they done did some stupid shit. They had clouded judgment. They fucked around. They fucked with the wrong one when they came for you. Clarify angry. Who is this that's angry spirit? Clarify angry for my divine connections. Somebody that's a nightlife groupie. You know what I'm saying? This is somebody that likes to party. They like to hang out in the clubs. They like to go to places where they can pick up these rich men or these rich women. But I don't feel like they got no money. And, and they shit may be deadly. I don't even trip off the fact that she holding knives in front of her shit. She may have something. This person could have been married to your person. Or they could have wanted to get married to your person. They could have married for money. Yeah, this is the karmic for sure, y'all. There she go. Or there he go. So if I copycat one, and this person is selfish, moody, childish, petty. That's why they did this fucking magic. And then it backfired. Backfire. Now they judgment all fucked up. Yeah, it says someone you know. This could be somebody that you know. See, they need a job. I told you, whoever this is, they don't have any money. They're, they're broke, right? And they dealing with or who are married to somebody that was taking care of them, paying their way. And whoever they were dealing with, I feel like is walking away. They're coming to you because you're the real deal here. They they know that this person is a copycat, and now this person is angry. And there we go, the karmic. The karmic is angry, and they want to know who you are. You know what I'm saying? Why is this person walking away from them to come towards you? Because uh, they got released. This, 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 um, it came out as the, uh, Sugar daddy, sugar mama, released whoever this person was. Maybe they didn't give them the marriage or they are divorcing them. And this karmic is upset. And they petty. So they try to do this magic because they don't want their money to go. That person leaves, they got to go get a job. They got to go back to working. They will no longer be taken care of. Yeah. Yeah. This person is coming towards you because you made yourself a priority. And you always make yourself a priority. You know your worth. And whoever this copycat is, they they got issues. They're codependent. Can't make it up. <laughs> they codependent upon whoever the sugar daddy or sugar mama is. It's a codependent relationship. Not enough give and take in that relationship. And they're angry because this person is walking away. Clarify the marriage here. Yeah, see, this person thought they was going to be happy. They thought they was getting a marriage, or if they were married, they thought they were going to be in this marriage. This person was going to take care of them. But they didn't get that. Yeah, the spirit says there was divine protection. So maybe this person thought they were going to marry this person. They thought they were going to get this long-term committed relationship here with this person. Why does the light look like that? Hold on, y'all. Let's see if that's better. Is that better? A little bit. Okay. Um, this person thought they were gonna get get this person. It was a trap. And I don't feel like they got the marriage or they didn't get the commitment. Clarify selfish moody petty. Yeah, see. They're upset because, Divine, you are star status. You out here doing your shit. You look good, man or woman. You smell good, you're shining, you're shining, you're star status. 
You don't need the sugar mama or the sugar daddy. You are you are independent, not codependent. And this copycat wanna be you is codependent. And they selfish, moody, childish, and petty. And your person's had enough of it. Yeah. This person was a thief. They only wanted what they could get from your person. They need to get up and go get a job. Yeah. You and your person have a spiritual connection. Nothing's going to stop or block that. Yeah. This karma need to go somewhere. They need grounding. They got work-life pressures and stuff. Now they stress the fuck out. Because now they got to go back to work. This man is leaving. They're going to be stuck with some kids. They losing their shit right now. Yeah. Because this person was their support. And the support is leaving. There's no more support here. And now this, this karmic is angry. It's time to boss up. Chris said, karmic boss up. Fix your credit. Get back at it. Don't get that degree. Stop trying to depend on these uh men or women to take care of you. Become independent. I'm going to put some tarot on this. See, Divine Femme, you're already in that energy because you know you got it. You're in the star status energy here. Clarify this angry. You see, the karmic could be sending your person love messages, trying to apologize, wanting to make up. And your person is not trying to hear it. And your person, um, your person, yeah, <laughs> they are um no longer stuck, no longer trapped by this karmic. They have released this karmic, and the karmic is upset. But this karmic is losing their mental. Okay, they they are they're going crazy. They're trapped in their head. They feel powerless now because this divine masculine has finally stood up in their power. They're no longer strapped. Oh, I can't talk. No longer stuck or trapped in this connection. This this karmic feels like your divine master is finna come be happy with you. Y'all finna be on this star status. Does she feel like you stole her man or you stole his girl? Yeah, third, third, three of swords here, the third party. Heartbreak. She may feel like you're the third party here. Um, or he may feel like you're the third party. But there's a love triangle. But this person is jealous. They're in pain. Because they don't want this person to come be happy with you. And your person is no longer stuck with this third party. And they could be coming to you to apologize. Because they're no longer stuck with this third party. They could be coming in to present you with a solid offer. And this could be why the karmic is angry. Because you are star status. And this karmic is losing their shit. They selfish, moody, and childish, and petty. This karmic could have been carefully planning some shit. The magic that they were doing trying to stop this person from coming toward you. But it didn't work. Everything they sent toward you has now been sent back to, to your person. But your person, um, not your person, this karmic had clouded judgment. Yeah, and they're receiving karma. Karmic lessons. Resurrection, spiritual awakening. Yeah. So this person, your person, has received karma. The karmic has received karma, or is receiving karma as we speak. The karmic is angry. They do feel like you stole their person. Or well, you stole their money, because it, it, it wasn't... It was never about the person. It was always about the money. So with the person coming towards you to give you the offer here, you, you're taking what they feel was theirs, their support, their help. Divine connections. Yeah. And they're angry because this person's going to come take this leap of faith with you. This person is now functioning in their free will. Your person could have been up under magic as well. To cloud their judgment. But your person's going to come have a fresh start with you. And this karmic is losing their shit. 
Look, this 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 divine masculine is out of there. They jumped off off the rock like I'm gone. I'm free. Yeah. This 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 karma can no longer hold on to this divine masculine. Yeah, th she's no longer getting this love off her. And she knows how aggressive she knows he's coming towards you or she, or he's coming towards you or she's coming towards you, right? Um, because with you is wish fulfillment, celebration, joy, contentment, emotional fulfillment here. They're coming towards you because you are you are you are a solid prospect. Yeah, they're coming to offer you this ace of cups, pure love, miracles from God, a spiritual awakening. And they're headed towards you quickly for communication. And to move forward with you. And they got drive and passion. They're going to express themselves. They're coming in with a proposal. And it's, it's swift communication. Quick quick communication about this proposal. About this offer of love. Because they see the Ten of Pentacles with you. Ultimate happiness. The legacy. Values. Power couple energy. And this is why the karmic is angry. And when they come towards you. They're coming in this King of Wands energy. This alpha energy. This boss leader. You know what I'm saying? This intense, fiery energy. They finally got their power back. And they're coming in to put some action in. They're going to take a risk. Okay? It's going to be a spontaneous endeavor. It's going to happen when you least expect it. But they are going to return. There will be reconnection here. Nostalgia. Kindness. This is a soulmate coming back towards you. So if it resonates, guys, let me know. It could be a twin flame, twin ray, divine partner, or life partner. There's a soul connection. Coming back towards you here, okay? Um, all my information is down below. The zodiac signs will be down below. Um, if you want to book a personal, buy any of my products, all that information is down below as well in the description box. Until next time, you keep rocking with me. I'm gonna keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, my TT babies.